Hello friends, today we're going to share a few things about what my mom got at Costco and other stores. So you don't want to miss one thing from this video. So stick around and we're going to dive right in. So these are some of the things I got at Aldi. I got um, just almond milk and cauliflower rice. I am doing the easy pizza casserole this week, so I'm going to be using those for that. And um, sweet and sour chicken over rice, and I'm doing part cauliflower rice, part um, brown rice. And then deli turkey meat, applesauce, we use those a lot on our homeschool community days. And um, some seltzer water, some pumpkin. I'm excited for pumpkin season. We got some, what are those? Beef jerky. Beef jerkies, thank you. And some coleslaw. I'm making some egg roll in a bowl. That's like a super easy 15 minute dinner. I love it. And some cheese, some bananas, some carrots. My kids have been really enjoying the baby carrots recently. And zucchini. I wanted a bit more zucchini, but I'm hoping to get some at the farmer's market. And then some tomatoes and some chocolate. So we got some bagels. These aren't on plan, but Saturday morning here at our house is bagel morning. My son will make bagels, his famous bagels for all of his siblings and himself. So it's always fun for them. And then I got some uh, sprouted bread and some yogurt and a favorite of my kids here recently. They'll put some honey or sweetener in it and then mix in some frozen blueberries that we picked from a farm this summer so that it's been super yummy some seal cut oats my husband's preference and then the old-fashioned oats and some radishes i got these um, little potatoes this week i'm going to do some potatoes and then i have meatballs in the freezer one night this week for um, a quick and easy another quick and easy meal and then pepperoni for um, pizza and a movie night some onion powder, and I've been really enjoying having these on hand, um, either making a lot of the freshie bowl here recently or also roasted peppers, super yummy. That's it for Aldi. So these are some of the things that I got at Costco this week, and I strategically get things at each store, sometimes because it's the cheaper option and sometimes because it's the cleaner option or the cleaner, cheaper option combined. And um, this week I am doing a two week trial, free trial for Instacart. And so I actually had everything delivered, which was super nice. Um, there is like a servicing fee, but if you um, choose to allow it to be delivered within a three hour window, you have the option of getting $2 off. So then it ends up being maybe two to four dollars to deliver the groceries to your house which um, in our case it's been kind of a crazy week so it really seems worth it this week anyway so let's dive right in here um, I love these carrots versus the baby carrots so my husband and I like these um, so a big bag of the carrots and some yummy apples here and then the lemon juice this is just by far convenience clean um, straight uh, lemon juice nothing else added and it lasts a really long time I love it um, yes this there are cleaner bacon options but it's just really nice to have those on hand we love to throw them in salads and then mineral salt is something that mineral salt and coconut oil for example are something that is always by far cheaper at Costco and then um, mushrooms very convenient and um, Mushrooms are a good idea to get organic when you can because they do absorb a lot of the pesticides and things that are used. Um, it's just that this is a big box and they will go bad. Um, so you gotta just be intentional to use them up. And then egg whites, they are cheaper at Costco. And then I really like this brand of meat. And so these are currently $4 off. There are 16, um, casing free chicken sausages so i'm excited to use these throw them in the freezer for um, easy quick and easy meals look at the ingredient list just chicken and then some spices and you can understand everything you're eating i love that 
and then um, a box of spinach. I have been using spinach in my smoothies a lot here recently. Let me grab my lettuce, so the spring mix lettuce. They use some different lettuces, the one at Costco, than they do like at Aldi. And I've really been enjoying that. And so they're about the same price. Um, maybe slightly cheaper at Aldi, but I just went with that one this time. And then some blueberries, some raspberries. Again, these are bigger boxes, so but with a family, you eat them up pretty quickly. And a bag of mandarins and some organic celery sticks. I don't always get organic celery, but it is on the dirty dozen list as far as if you're going to get organic, maybe do the ones that are on the dirty dozen. So I decided to um, just get some of those this time. And that is it for Costco this trip around. Call me crazy, but this is often what <laughs> a lot of my grocery haul looks like from Walmart. So I love just getting the um, non-starchy veggies just frozen in a bag. And these are my favorites, the broccoli. We like these green beans and um, cauliflower. Now, I do not like okra a lot in dishes where I actually see it and taste it but I've been really enjoying the mint chip chocolate shake I am telling you you don't really you don't taste it or what have you every once in a while the little white um, parts if you don't blend it really well you will taste that but um, I like to hide it in things because it is so good for you it's so good for your gut it's so good for your immunity then I also will puree it and put it in soups for like a thickener um, and our Walmart was out for a while so I'm so excited to be getting okra again and um, then my favorite thing again a lot of times I won't even use a recipe for a meal I will throw some of these on a pan throw some of my favorite seasonings roast it in the oven get some bulk meat that I have pre-prepped in the freezer like meatballs or chicken or what have you and um, again just put some of my favorite seasonings or sauce that I have made and there's my meal um, add a little bit of pasta or bread and it's a meal for the whole family so these are some of the things that I got at Walmart today so these are just a few other things that I got at Walmart this is something for example that is feeding a family on a budget totally not on plan so to speak but it's just something that we use for our kids, for snacks, for on the go or what have you. And I normally get them at Aldi, but they didn't have them currently. And then the mox mellows, just a yummy treat. So then I am, I got some salsa. I'm going to be making some sweet and sour chicken this week. I am super excited. Um, it's a recipe that's super simple that I've used for years, but I'm Trim Healthy Mama ifying it, if you will. And so it's basically just your rice. I'm gonna mix rice and cauliflower rice. And then you do chicken in taco seasoning. And then you mix um, salsa and it has you put in a jar of like apricot jam. But I just got done making the apricot wow spread in the Trim Healthy Mama Future Cookbook. And so I'm just gonna combine those two. And so I'm really excited. I'll have to take a picture and let you know how that turns out. And then again, whenever I run out of the Trim Healthy Mama Stevia, this is my Stevia of choice. I have a video on this, and it is by far the most worth your money, if you will. And then this, if you have not used this yet, I highly recommend it. Yes, it is a plant protein, so it's not gonna be have all of your, um, a complete protein or what have you. It is low carb and it is clean. So that's what I love about it, and here's how I use it. I basically um, take it whenever the recipes call for protein powder. I will do part of the really good stuff like collagen or what have you, and then I will do part of this protein powder. Why? Because this is $12 a bag. Um, the other protein powder, which is super, super, super good for you, is more expensive. So this is how I stretch my budget to feed a family on a budget, is I mix part this, Part the other protein powder so if you have not tried this yet you need to try it you need to get it in your pantry so that is it for this week and I hope you all have a blessed week take care we were blessed with farmers market coupons so we were blessed with this produce we went to the farmers market also and so I got this gigantic zucchini and the yellow squash was so beautiful and then some fresh tomatoes some cherry tomatoes some plums, cucumbers, potatoes, and some peaches, some apples, and some pears. 
and I don't know, um, call me weird if you want, but I love produce that has scratches and imperfections on it and that isn't super waxy because to me that's real food and it's more natural. And like my dad always says, if it's sprayed so much and things that um, like maybe bugs don't even want to eat it, which there's no bugs on these, but then why would we want to eat it? You know, um, I just love things that are more, look more realistic, fresh and natural. I don't mind that. Um, so I'm just really excited. I just feel like the food, you can smell it so much more. It's so much more aromatic and um, just has so much more flavor. And so we're really excited to enjoy these things that we were blessed with. I just wanted to show you real quick. I almost forgot um, just some of my things I got in pulled from the garden here recently. So um, I normally like to pick my zucchinis before they get this big, but this guy just kind of grew up out of nowhere real quick. So I'm excited for the zucchini. And then um, just some mini peppers, super excited for those, and some tomatoes. So nothing beats getting something straight from your garden. Hello friends, today we're gonna to share a few things about what our mom got at Costco and other stories. <laughs> <laughs>